how to check your website traffic on a GoDaddy website. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. In today's video I'm going to show you how simple and easy it is to check up a GoDaddy traffic that has been implemented into the uh, GoDaddy account of yours. This is going to be very easy and simple and it will let you know what is exactly the traffic is about and also the source of it and how you can manage it. So we are going to head over to GoDaddy.com, sign in into our account, click on my products and you're going to see all the uh, websites that you have created. So as much as you are going to create more websites and as much as you are going to get the all uh, the access for the traffic or the surveillance or the analytics for that website. So we are going to ignore the websites first and we are going to basically keep an eye on only the website that we want to have. For example, I'm going to have this one, the test one, which is going to be having this subdomain as 223127. So we are going to be back in here. I do not want to click on that website. I'm going only to save that in my mind. So we are going to scroll down and you are going to see websites plus marketing. And we're going to see all the websites that has been named. So as you can see here, uh, websites plus marketing intelligence pre we are going to have this one, that one, that, 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 and we're going to see more. So basically I'm going to see that it is going to be this one. Make sure that it is going to be the same website. Click on manage. Wait for a few seconds until it is going to show up the dashboard for the marketing services. So this is the logo for that website. As you can see, this is the site visitors or the traffic that has been uh, implemented onto the uh, last 30 days as you can see we have uh, 36 visitors for the orders it is going to keep a track of your orders if you have uh, something bought from your website the sales also it is going to have some reports on your uh, sales bookings also and uh, the social views for example post on social media to get more um, traffic so basically you are going to manage your uh, socials and the final one is going to be the performance score so basically or based on the all of the um, uh, results or the analysis from these you're going to get a performance score and the higher score means that you're going to have engaged visitors so as much as you are going to have everything uh, named up or ranking up in the um, numbers it is going to be very important to see that you're going to do well Basically, if you're not doing well, just in my case, but it is going only to uh, show you here how things work because I haven't uh, posted anything into that website and also I'm going to put it only for testing. You can see that it is going to be on draft. Now, uh, let's say that we have uh, everything bad. So we want to uh, in increase a little bit of the quality in here. So we are going to have the website, the marketing, and also the appointments. As you can see, we have nine items that we can, um, let's say here, uh, upgrade or uh, make better for the website. We are going to have three, three on marketing and also two on appointments. So we can go ahead and see the tasks that we are going to get. Basically, make sure that you have a set up the contact info the about section here we have the logo upload media to use on your site link your let's say here facebook page and etc improve your website by setting up some of the uh, as you can see attaching a custom domain links to your social media account set up seo receivers uh, to receive a more uh, traffic in your website grow your audience by having an expert to help marketing your website and etc and here we have it so you can go ahead and follow up these steps and when you finish you're going to see that the performance score has been uh, increased a little bit or better than it is going to be in this case. That was pretty much it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I hope that you have enjoyed the content and I hope to see you soon on the next one.